Hartford this morning, Laurel Street is still closed from K Street to Farmington Avenue after an underground explosion yesterday afternoon. Yeah, that rocked things up in the city for sure. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Audrey Russo is live now where it all started. And Audrey, uh, what is the latest this morning? We still see a crew behind you. What's going on? Yeah, crews are still working out here, Nicole and Wendell, but fortunately, uh, everybody is safe, although it didn't really feel like that yesterday. Residents we spoke to say that they could feel the explosion from their homes when this all happened around 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Now, crews tell us that a manhole cover just blew off, and they could see smoke and fire streaming from the street. Really just a scary situation out here on Laurel Street. When crews arrived and started digging, they identified a six inch water main break along with an electrical fire underground. Now they had to shut the water off to start repairs. In this case, they don't know whether it was the water main break or the electrical fire that started first, but the aftermath was alarming. And it wasn't just from a manhole, the street had heaved and there's a fairly large crack um, running uh, eight to ten feet long uh, past the manhole, which is unusual. I was sitting in my chair watching TV there, and all of a sudden, uh, this outrageous boom went off. And I got up and went to the windows after my windows literally popped open. Now, crews, you can see, are still out here, as is a very vocal cat. I don't know if you've been able to hear it throughout the entire live shot. There's a cat right by us, and I'm going to try really hard not to take it home with me. But uh, Laurel Street is still closed this morning. There's no timetable for when it's going to reopen, but it's going to be closed between K Street and Farmington Avenue. Live in Hartford, Audrey Russo for Channel 3 Eyewitness News.